And a month later, they are a game over 500. Drive to center field, right center, and deep at the wall. See ya. I think it's in play. Kerwin Danley, the second base umpire out there, had palms down it. How the wall is elevated a little bit. There's an extra bit of padding out there in right field. But how about the start to this ball game? But it is a three bagger for Springer. Probably the biggest thing as the ground ball goes fair ball down the right field side. That'll produce a run. Springer scores. Marwin will hold it first base RBI single. And the Astros after two hitters lead it one nothing here in the first. Works the 2 0. Hammered on a line deep to right field. Going back and off the right field wall. Orlando will get it back in, but Marwin Gonzalez scores on a long RBI single. It's 2-0 Houston. Line drive into left field. That drops for a hit. Freezing and then scoring is Correa. It's now 3-0 RBI single Gomez. And the Astros have runners at first and second. Kind of makes you wonder if that swing from George Springer almost getting out of here on that first A-B has rattled him a little bit. Pitch has popped up shallow into left field. Going out and deep is Escobar, and he'll drop it. And now everybody's safe. Rasmus scoring. It no doubt will be ruled an E6, but the Astros take it to a 4 0 lead here in the first, and again, still just one out. Rammed into right field, solid base hit. That'll score Gomez. Valbuena held at third base. Everybody moves up 90 feet. And another line shot off the Astros bats. It is 5-0 Houston. Nine hitters have come to the plate. And now you roll it through again as George Springer comes to the plate. And George Springer, one for wow. one with a triple, hits one high and deep left field. See ya, and that's legit on this one. That is the third grand slam of the year for George Springer. Bottom of the third, Jose Altuve off of Corey Kluber starts the scoring. Here's a two-run double bringing in Luis Valbuena and Jason Castro. Later that inning, they're loaded for Colby Rasmus. This is a two-run single, getting Altuve and George Springer home. 4-0 Houston, part of a five-run third inning that knocked out Kluber. Pick it up first inning, John Lester facing David Fries with two men on. Kicks off the glove of Bryant, and everybody's going to be safe. Bases are loaded. Jose Osuna down toward the corner. Schwarber can't get there. Two-run double, Jose Osuna. Pirates up 3-0. Jordy Mercer with the infield back. Ground ball into left field, a base hit. Bell scoring, Osuna waved home. Here comes the throw. It won't get him as the Pirates lead 5-0. Yeah, you're starting to look toward the end of Lester's day if he doesn't get Cervelli here. And that one's deep out to left. And there it goes! A grand slam for Cervelli! What an inning for the Pirates! You gotta be kidding! And Lester's still out there. And McCutcheon hits one out. And there it goes! Put it on the board! Ten for the Pirates in the first! Unbelievable! You'll never see this again. Wow! No, you won't. You won't ever see it again. Facing you, Darvish. And that's ripped deep to left field, and you can kiss that one goodbye. Into the Landry's Crawford boxes. Yuli Gurriel with his first postseason home run, and it's 1 0 Astros. Oh, how the game has changed. That's now 12 different players who have hit a home run in this World Series. The record is 13. And now Marwin Gonzalez, the switch hitting utility player who's been manning left field for this postseason. 1 2. Fly ball to left center. Back is Taylor on the move. Can't get it. Off the wall. Reddick coming to the plate. No throw. 2 0 Houston. Thirty-five pitches for Darvish working in the second. Now it's Brian McCann. Still no one out in the inning. And McCann lines it in the right center for a base hit. Gaddis tucking around third and coming home. He will score well ahead of the throw. Into third base goes Gonzalez. An RBI for Brian McCann. His first hit in the World Series. Three to nothing Astros. First and third one out. That's in the center. It is caught, tagging, coming to the plate. Gonzalez throw to the 4-0 Astros. 
Armstrong. Ricky Henderson Field, Ricky the all-time leader in leadoff home runs, and maybe George Springer will catch him one day. That's his eighth of the season for the big league lead. It's off Sonny Gray, and the Strohs have a 1-0 lead. Now a 2-0 game later in the inning, 2-1 and 2 down. Yuli Gurriel on an 0-2 pitch. That's an RBI double, and the Strohs have a 3-0 lead. The next batter, Alex Bregman. Another pair come in on the 2-1 single to cap a five-run inning for Houston. Already one nothing Rangers. When Prince Fielder singles into right field, Carlos Beltran will then make an error. Two runs come across on the play, and Texas leads this one three zip. Later in the frame, Elvis Andrews will single into right center field. That brings home two more. It's 5 nothing Rangers, and CeCe's done after two and a third. Esmiel Rogers comes out of the bullpen. The second man he faces is Carlos Corporan, who goes the other way for an RBI ground rule double. It's 6 nothing Rangers. Later in the frame, it's 7-zip, and Shinsu Chu will hit a three-run homer to left. The Rangers score 10 runs in the third inning. Lots of